y'all hey i'm back today on our monday off and i'm so grateful for the time that i had uh today to just spend some time being creative and i also got an opportunity to delve a little bit more into some things that were sent to me from some dear friends and i want to share that with you today because it was so special to me so um first i have a lot of dear friends <laughs> and i get a lot of happy mail but recently i received um a package from shauna klingerman and joanna who uh both both of these ladies have been very special to me especially within the past year um i formed a bond with them both for uh different reasons and i'm gonna share more of that with you today so first i'm going to show you the package that i got from shauna she had been working on this for the longest time and had been sharing with me every time we talked she was like i got something for you it's coming <laughs> And so I would often just say to her, you know, don't stress yourself, don't worry. But in sharing about our lives with each other and all of our frustrations and things that we had been dealing with, um, she sent this package right on time. And so uh, the first thing I saw when I opened it was this very beautiful bag. Um, and, and these words are just words that I needed to read and see at that time. Also, for those of you who don't know, my words of the year are focus and bloom. And so seeing, you know, the flower uh, being held in the hand was significant to me as well. And so I wanna show y'all what came inside. All of this wasn't in the bag, but I put everything she sent me in the bag because it's so deep <laughs> and it fit all of the things. But also uh, quickly, Shauna is so sweet. She puts notes all over everything she sends me. So she sent this note and then um, there's also another little note here hanging off the bag on the tag where she just basically just expresses either why she picked up the item for me or uh, you know, something sweet, a sweet sentiment connected to that thing. So I'm going to lift this bag now and share with you some of the things that are on the inside. So first, um, she sent me this mini composition book. She and I both love mixed media. And she uh, is taking a class where she was learning this mixed media technique using these little mini journals. And so she sent me my own, which I'm so grateful for. And of course, she sent it in purple. <laughs> and then she also sent me, because I love Jane Davenport, she sent me, and I'm gonna take this out the bag, sent me this pen that she actually got from Jane Davenport at Creativation um, some years ago. So I was so excited to see that. Uh, not only because <laughs> it, you know, because it represents Jane Davenport, but also because um, she has a teal scarf on and she has pink hair. It's just two, two of, it's like a Laquisha and a Shauna mixed in one pen. <laughs> and so, this will be treasured by me and of course she stuck a little note on that um and then next i'm going to show you um this paintbrush set that she sent me just because it was <laughs> my my colors i love purple teal and gold and so she found this set and she put a note on there noting that it's not a fancy set, but she thought of me when she saw it. So the idea that I had when I talked to her after receiving this package, she confirmed it. That's what she was thinking I would do is use these uh, paint brushes to stage my photos. So I'm very grateful for that. And I'm saving the best for last y'all, but all of these items are super awesome. Um, she hand lettered my words of the year and put them on this mug. So I have my word of the year, both of them on one cup, Focus and Bloom. And this is um, the second mug that I've gotten from Shauna. So I also have one that says Confidence, um, which I actually drank out of earlier today. So this was a surprise. I was not expecting it. And I was just so grateful to get this small reminder of uh, my word of the year and the last thing i want to show you you all she really 
put some thought and love into. And I'm actually gonna zoom in on this uh, once I open it. But she made me this little mini journal. So I'm gonna zoom in because I want you to see um, the intricacies of this. And I love this message y'all. So I'm gonna keep that in, this, in the camera screen. But, um, so I like junk journaling. I like traditional journaling. I like mixed media. I like scraps thrown together <laughs> in a very interesting way. And Shauna did all of that here in this little mini book. So I'm gonna share with you all what this looks like on the inside. First of all, this is a chunky little thing. I'm gonna show y'all just how much she put in here from looking at how thick it is. And I love all the strings hanging off, but I definitely got them tangled up <laughs> when I retied it. So look at how chunky this is. This was all Shauna and she customized it to me. I even love the uh, fabric on the outside, how she sewed it and all of this. It was just super cute. Okay, so we'll, I'll take you page by page on the inside. So this is actually my favorite page. I love the strings hanging, but I wanna make sure you see everything. <laughs> so she put a B for bestie. And then on this side it says, some years are for growing, this year you will bloom. So I just, I love how she put like little reminders in here, uh, very specific to my word of the year and where she knows I'm trying to go. And so on this next page, um, <laughs> she knows that I love Hello Kitty. So she stuck some Hello Kitty stickers inside of here, some puffy stickers inside this little purple pocket. And there's a lot of little pockets and things where she stuck like some little stuff in there. Um, here's another little pocket with um, a sticker that says Hope, and I love that background. Then on this page, it says Stay Gold. Y'all know gold is one of my things. I love this. <laughs> and then all the texture that she included in there as well. Here are um, more stickers and a little tag. And she, I believe she painted this. Some vellum here with on the other side I love that she put my art my art information or my art name and then on this side more hope on the rainbow and this uh, mixed media like a uh, piece that she stuck inside more stickers it says you make me happy some more mixed media and another little tuck place for a card wildflowers of america that's definitely me i'm wild a wildflower <laughs> and a little ticket as well and then make sure i don't skip any pages and then she put a cue for queen oh my gosh <laughs> and i love the gold uh, glittery letters this purple dually some vellum, some more Hello Kitty stickers. And this is some of my favorite washi tape from Dina Wakely. He says, make my voice strong in that area. You shine with butterflies. Oh my gosh, all the things I love. This handmade purple paper, this is love. Some more mixed media paper. Y'all, and we're still not, or barely halfway through the book with what I already showed you. Put your heart out and then um, some pretty uh, napkin here. There's another little pocket with some stickers inside. I love this. So it was because of this page <laughs> that I kept my mail this week. <laughs> because I was like, oh, I love how she tore that uh, piece and stuck it inside my book. So I kept some of my mail that looked like this on the inside and she put my words of the year, focus and bloom. And then here is um, some floral paper here. Another little pocket with some more stickers. And here again, 
she put just keep creating a nice little reminder to me to keep going on those days that get tough some more hello kitty you can never have enough hello kitty <laughs> this beautiful lavender doily life is beautiful and that's one of those cards that you open with another message on the inside but i'm probably not going to open it because i'm not going to do anything i like i just want to keep this book as is i've been debating on if i should try to do something inside of it but i really just appreciate the thought that went into this so i'm probably going to keep it just like this for a while i also love that little attachment that she did there and then here this pretty little card on the back it says sure the world breeds monsters but kindness grows just as wild and so i really appreciate that cute floral card with the teal more floral paper put my first initial here it says you are the bestiest <laughs> i love that more of the envelope paper here some more stickers and napkins. Um, some mixed painted paper here. And then this is like uh, washi samples clipped to this page. Some more Hello Kitty stickers because you can never have enough. Some more painted paper. Oh my goodness, just so much thought went into this. And somebody sat down and made this for me, y'all. I just. Um, my heart was touched and this was a tough uh, past few weeks as well in February as a lot is going on in education and so receiving this in the mail was just so on time I love the pages the colors of these two pages here um, it's another sticker do everything in love and then with that mixed media background <laughs> yes queen <laughs> oh gosh i love 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 this so here's another little pocket with some little things inside my initial a feather a sticker a ticket on some mixed media background look at that y'all love that texture and then this says you are loved another piece of ticket here Hello Kitty again. And I'm gonna try to skip anything. And then she stuck some vellum and a label here. And she thanked me for being me on this very last page with those Jane Davenport eyes in the background. <laughs> so I, y'all, all this put together just for me. I was so, so grateful. So Shauna, if you watch this, thank you so much. I'm going to treasure this little book. I have had um, a couple of friends in the past couple of months send me these beautifully handmade books. Um, my friend Michelle Field, Talia of Chasing the Olives. Like I got all these cute handmade books in my home that I just don't want to touch, but um, I'm receiving more and I'm going to do my best to, to fully utilize them because I think it's important to, to really experience these lovely precious items while I'm here on earth, right? And so all of this is from Shauna and I absolutely adore her. So I'm going to put that to the side now because I want to show you something else I received from my friend Joanna. So first of all, the only reason I love this stamp on the inside of this box, the only reason I knew this was from Joanna is because of this card. Um, <laughs> on the outside, it was from um, the person who curated what's inside. And so I was like, who is that? <laughs> and then when I saw this, I was like, oh, that's my girl. <laughs> so um, this is from, what you're getting ready to see is from Sweet Lotus Clay Company. Um, and this person creates clay jewelry. So apparently Joanna saw these earrings and felt that I had to have them. And so she sent them to me directly through the company. Um, here's a sticker that came in here. It says, oh, y'all know I'm using this, this mixed media sticker. As a matter of fact, I might stick this inside of my little 
book from Shauna because look look how beautifully that pairs together but um one of the things that I wanted to say is Joanna is um, my friend that I read through the Bible in a year with last year. And she also just had her baby boy, who is my nephew. And <laughs> I um, am so grateful for her progress and success because we prayed for some of the things that we're seeing manifest now in her life. And it has just been a huge blessing to experience it in real time. Now, side note, and in all transparency, there were two pieces of chocolate in here. I ate those. Praise the Lord. <laughs> and then uh, this sticker came inside as well. And so let's get to it and show y'all what she thought or uh, what she picked out and thought of me when she saw. So Joanna saw these earrings and said, had them sent to me. I absolutely love these. Two, I'm, I'm sure that for those of you who have been on my page or followed me for a while, you already know why, but quickly, my favorite colors are purple, teal, and gold. All three of those colors are here, <laughs> as well as um, I love afros. And so um, this just exudes like elegance and um, Afrocentric beauty. I just love these and so grateful that Joanna thought of me when she saw them. They're also handmade, you all, I believe. Um, I think that, again, the um, person who curated this made them from clay. So if you're interested in checking her out online, it is called Sweet Lotus Clay Company. So check them out and um, I appreciate you all so much for joining me tonight. Not a tutorial evening, but definitely uh, an evening of feeling loved and appreciated by two dear friends. And I'm so excited um, to go into this four day week with confidence, knowing that I'm loved. And I just wanna say a special thank you to Shauna and Joanna for sharing that love with me this past weekend. So love you all, I'll see you next time.